elevator. Oh, right. Yeah, the, the, the upper part of the elevator. This is just the, oh, I see. This is just yeah. the, the motor. Yeah. yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah. And everywhere there's an opening, you've got that little splash yeah. of sunlight just oh, going through. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this would give us away for sure. Yeah, yeah. It's not the first time, that's why I'm asking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Quite like a GoPro setup. It's very lightweight. It's quite yeah. compact. It's yeah. really good. I said because mainly I just use it without anything, just the camera. Yes. Yeah, just hold it. Yeah. The only thing I find is um, that handle. If you like, saying I've got my ring there. Uh -huh. My ring. Uh, it transmits into the microphone. Uh, ah, you can, you can, yeah, right, you can hear it. Tourists never come here because it's too too long. It takes too much time, you know. So they normally come, stand in front of the antenna where we flew the drone, take pictures, turn around, and go back to the bus. Day trippers. Yeah. The Duga trip is half an hour, 15 minutes walking, 15 minutes talking. That's it. They don't even know this, this beautiful thing exists here. This is cool. Really gives us more space, you know, so we have to go through here Like different old-school electronics yeah. everywhere Some filming? Yeah, you bet. Okay. <laughs> I'll wait until we go upstairs.
top floor. Secret. Совершенно <laughs> секретно so, in Russian. So all this was just one computer, and there are many more server rooms on the top floor. This building is designed in a really smart way. So the ground floor, that's why we skipped it. Yeah. Because it was just the power supply. There's transformers, relays, yeah. switches, cables. Second, first floor was ventilation. Was beneath. Yeah. There were pumps, big pumps that would blow the air through the computers like this and then the cold air was collected on the side uh, so it was the whole building was designed for running these super powerful computers yeah, yeah to keep it cool yeah uh, but yeah. also to reclaim the heat yeah and at that time you know with the with the technology of 70s i bet yeah. the computers were not really energy efficient no so no. they were burning most of the electricity and the heat, turning into heat Wow. This is another room, but for three computers. Yeah. You can see the main control panel over there. And uh, another one there. There's three, three uh, controllers for three computers. Wow. Yeah. Oh, are we going this way? This um, way? No, 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 we have to go back the same way. Okay. Oh, no yeah. screen, nothing, just a bunch of yeah. buttons. And lights. Guys, lights. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Massive. Yeah. And on the other side, there is a main control room for the whole station. Valley of the Beast. <laughs> there. This one? Yeah. Oh, wow. You can imagine people sat behind these consoles. Yeah. Yeah. That was the main one, the primary console. Yeah. These are secondary ones, and there was the screen or the display. Yeah, it's right there. With the, with the lights. Blinking red, green, and orange, red, green, and yellow. Look at the beautiful light fittings as well oh, on the. Yeah. Oh, they built the control room yeah. with the style. You know? Oh, yeah. Look at the walls. It's yeah. Cool. Super it's beautiful. Material. Yeah. No windows. No. Nothing. No windows, no one can see in. Yeah. <laughs> People turn up and like flip flops and say, yeah, but why it's forbidden? <laughs> you must be an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> flip flops in the middle. <laughs> Walking in the garage and nailing the bricks. because they had to even reinforce the room inside. Yeah, yeah. From the roof you can actually see both antennas wow. in front of you. But that's a really, really cool spot. And after that we'll just go downstairs and back to the gate. Okay. 
the roof. around. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for this. That's all right. Oh boy. Wow. Shit. It's purely because of the bad design. Yeah. You see the pillars are made of bricks. Yes, the yes, I don't understand that. It's like concrete slabs. Yeah, concrete slab yeah. floors, but yeah. then unsupported on brick pillars. Yeah. So with no reinforcement. Remember about five year plans. Yeah. Quicker, faster, higher. Yeah. What stronger. was it what was it called in Russian? The uh, five year plan. Bitilitka. Bitilitka. It was uh they had like twenty eight or twenty nine of them, something like that. Yeah. So Bitilitka. Mm. Very frequently, you still can find in Pripyat, like, we're gonna uh, exceed the, yeah. the, 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 the achievement set, or the goals set by government by 1987, da-da-da. And uh, it's, it's a lot of that. Yeah. They, that was their main idea, you know. Like, national pride. Yeah, national pride, exactly. Yeah. see as well it's 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 a double whammy this because you've got the the you know Soviet Union history you've got the disaster mm -hmm. you've got the the beautiful urbex locations it's cultural there's so many paths yes. crossing yeah in this one place yeah. don't forget about science yeah, and science, of course. It's also a yeah. very important part of Chernobyl zone. Yeah, there's a real depth to that relief. Maybe that's a better angle. Yeah. It's cold, beautiful. It's beautiful. Looks very futuristic. Right? It does, yeah. And it's uh, yeah, it's not good for the buildings. But this this is an art school. This is an abandoned art school. Yeah. There's nothing left. It's completely empty. Yeah. Uh, it was actually used after the accident by. I don't know what, what agency, but it was clearly used for about 10, 12 years. So they, when they left, they left properly. So they did not abandon stuff. They took everything with them. Yeah. All the furniture, yeah. all the equipment. So these are just empty rooms. Wow. And also check the, the other uh, mosaic and the cinema on our way. 
So this one is called music, and there is another one called energy, which uh, also looks quite futuristic. Energy. Yeah, yeah, I can see. Wow, what remains of the screen? <laughs> oh. Most of the seat's gone. Yeah. It's a cool place. Not much left, but no. it's, yeah, it's a cool place. Yeah. Sometimes the floor is really bad. It's very springy. <laughs> oh, look, yeah, it's some growing. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> yeah. Well, if or you underneath really want something. To, <laughs> we can we'll make it, it hard. <laughs> we'll make it hard. Let's go hard way, you know. <laughs> yeah. First time. Yeah. I've not to really? squeeze my body underneath something or Yeah, but yeah. Uh, it, it can be the, the way. This is the other one. Oh, wow. Truly really beautiful. Yeah. This one, energy, did you? Energy, yes. yeah. Looks like a fire or a big torch. Yeah. It was representing nuclear energy. Uh, he, I was just going to say, yes. yeah, I was so just coming to that. The Prometheus, you know, from uh, Greek mythology. Yeah, yeah. The guy who stole the fire from gods yeah. and gave it to humans. Prometheus was a symbol of Pripyat, ironically. Um. And the uh, cinema was called Prometheus, and the statue was located right next to the cinema over there on the stand. And this, this artwork here was like completing the picture energy. Wow. Mm -hmm.